said there are 42 confirmed cases in Clark County. So far, one person has died. So testing is key to trying to stop the coronavirus and get an idea of how big it is. Well, that makes this memo yesterday from the Southern Nevada Health District pretty concerning. It says the district has to stop testing immediately. The reason? Well, its supply of reagents is gone and supplies are limited. Reagents are the chemical needed for the testing kit to identify the coronavirus. The health district's acting health director is advising health care providers to send test samples to LabCorp or Quest Diagnostics until further notice. 532. So this morning, one of the most congested, popular, best known streets in the world. It's a lot quieter. Every casino on Las Vegas Boulevard is now closed at the request of Governor Steve Sisolak. Thousands of people are out of work this morning, including employees of the state's largest employer. Our Hector Mejia is live along the strip this morning. Hector, it looks a lot different out there. It really does. Very quiet and empty out here. A few people are out. Some cars are out on the roadways, but the people walking along the Las Vegas Boulevard mainly are construction workers. And by the stroke of midnight, some places closed. Casinos are boarded up. What you see here is the Bellagio boarded up now. The fountains off to the side, pretty quiet this morning. And as we mentioned, by the stroke of midnight, every piece of gaming equipment in the state was shut down. A new video from overnight shows Metro Police blocking the entrance to some resorts. Taxis turned away from places like the Wynn and Encore and many other places around here. This is really weighing heavy for thousands of hospitality workers. No work for an entire month. More than a dozen resorts had already decided to close due to the health and economic fallout from the coronavirus pandemic. Yesterday, we told you when Governor Steve Sisolak asked all non-essential businesses to join the fight and close up shop for the next 30 days. My ultimate goal here is to come together as Nevadans to save lives. That requires aggressive strategies aimed at mitigating community spread. While a vaccine is being developed, we don't have time to waste. At this time, we must act aggressively and decisively to protect ourselves, our families, in our community. The governor said the goal is to slow the spread of COVID-19 so that local hospitals do not get overwhelmed. Sisolak stressed that this is not a vacation. Listen and that people should continue to practice social distancing. Back out here live, we're looking at the lake here outside the Bellagio where the NFL draft, well, they were supposed to build a massive stage here for the draft. We we're expecting a lot of people in town for the draft, but that will no longer be the case. Those events canceled. Meanwhile, the governor said he will provide more information on his suggestion to close up shop for the next 30 days later on today. Reporting live from a very quiet Las Vegas Strip, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now. All right. Thank